Welcome everybody to the Biker Map Live. This is Johnny Throttle as your co-host, and I'm alongside with Patty P. Good Pat morning, John. Patty P. How how do the listeners out there get to hear the Biker Map? Well, the Biker Map you can find us on our Facebook page for sure, and also it's going to be once a week on the radio station. So the podcast Biker Map Podcast Live is going to be aired on 104.3. 96.5 and 103.9 dash two, John. I believe you can go on to Beasley Media Group website and find all the podcasts there as well, can't they? Yes, yes. Very good. So, uh, you know, the name, I don't know about this name you got for me, Johnny Throttle. I don't know about that. <laughs> We're still looking for a girlfriend for Johnny Throttle. Well, out that's, there. that's beside the point, he's, you know. He's very swole. I'm swole? Yes. Swole, is that swole. a young people's term? I don't know. <laughs> it could be. Anyway, this portion of the Biker Map brought to, you, brought to you by Von Baron Motorcycles, located in South Fort Myers at 16770 Link Court, that's Suite 105 and 106, just off Alico Road. And to make it even better, we have the owner, owner, Chris? Yes, sir. Very sir. good. The owner of Von Baron Motorcycles in the studio with us, and that is Chris. Hello, Chris. Hi, how are you doing today? I'm, I'm well. Thank you for asking. Good, good. Chris, tell us a little bit about Von Baron Motorcycles. Uh, Von Baron Motorcycles, uh, we're a Via franchise dealer uh, located off just off Felico Road, off the of Gator. Um, we're also a full restoration, uh, repair, and customization shop. Uh, we've been there since 2012, and we love working on motorcycles, especially vintage motorcycles. That's kind of our specialty. And um, uh, we have a lot of motorcycles for sale. We do financing, and uh, we have a cool place. We do bike nights and music, and music food, food, a little bit of everything. Yeah, right? everybody loves to eat. Yep. Eat, and eat and uh, have fun. you know, Patty, Chris, a little bit nervous. He got that camera on him right there. See, it's, it's like he's freaking oh, out. He'll get used to it. Don't worry, Johnny. Uh, like I said before, it's a good thing the camera's not on me because once again, I do have a face for radio. Chris, uh, the vintage bikes, what's the coolest vintage bike that you've had in your shop? I would say just recently the coolest, one of the coolest bikes we had in is a 1990 Honda RC30. Um, it's very rare. There was only about 3,000 of them produced worldwide. 3,000? Mm -hmm. And they are worth? They're worth anywhere in the range from 50 to 60 grand. Wow, wow. Yeah. So do you get them into the shop in real disarray or are they just fine-tuning stuff? Do you have to rebuild the bike? Sometimes, you know, it just depends on the bike, but most of the bikes, when it comes to bikes like that, they're collectors. Most of the times, it's just an easy, uh, clean the carburetors out, put new batteries in it, get it running, shine it up, and just get it ready to put back in the collection for, for collectors. I, you know, Sometimes they sell them, and we actually offer a plethora of vintage motorcycles for sale. So, so you, the, the owners put them on consignment with you? Yes. Is that how it works? Yes. I would think that the coolest bikes would be the old Harleys and the old uh, Indian motorcycles, but no. Yeah, yeah, well, people like those too, but people are really going towards the old vintage sport bikes, the guys who didn't have the money when they were younger and now growing up, they have the funds and they want that old sport bike that they didn't have when they were younger. Now, so not, it's pretty, you know, not yeah. knowing much about vintage motorcycles, do you work on scooters too, like the old Vespas? We worked on pretty much everything. Scooters, all Japanese bikes, British bikes. And if you bring it in and you need somebody to work on it, we'll work on it. Patty, what do you think of uh, Von Baron Motorcycles? How did you meet Chris? And tell us a little bit about your history there. I just love their shop. It's right off of Valico. And I think that, you know, I, I really think that you kind of hit like the, the Naples market and the Estero market really well. So definitely, if you live in those areas, check out Von Baron Motorcycles. You'll love their shop. Uh, when you come in, it's very inviting and it's just it's just on the edge. I, I just love that shop. There's just so much to look at, you know, so many cool things, and, and the shop is amazing. So definitely go and see Chris and Tina. They're great people. Usually on a Friday night, every couple months, they have a bike night there, John. And, uh, you know, Chris, you usually make something unusual to cook there, too. You usually do like a barbecue or something like that, right? Yep, yep. We do barbecues, and we have games and uh, slow races, and... We usually show off a cool bike or two or, you know, something we got that got in that's pretty interesting. We'll unveil it at the bike night. And it's just a good time to meet other bikers and, you know, get group rides going and, you know, just talk bikes and show off bikes and 
you know, it's a good time. And usually at the end of the night, there'll be some guys doing some wheelies and some burnouts. And, uh, mm. Yeah, so it's always fun. Yeah, I was, um, I, when I first, my first connection years and years ago, I was the voice of the All-American Motorcycle Rodeo, oh, which wow. traveled the Northeast. A guy named Chuck Schmidt from New Hampshire started it. And I would travel with him and I would get the bands and I would uh, do the announcing and stuff like that. So there were slow races, the hot dog challenge or whatever you call it, where the girls sit on the back and I won't mention what they do with it, but uh, that's up to them. And then uh, the they pull the sled, the sled pull, is that what it's called? Mm-hmm. And, and a whole that. bunch of different events. That's a lot of fun stuff to do. Probably happened in Daytona right now. Yeah, absolutely. Mm-hmm. Now, this is back before I think everybody except in the studio was born, with the exception of my friend Bill over here. <laughs> Uh, he might be a, about the age that would remember that because that was in the early 80s. Anyway, so back to Von Baron Motorcycles. You're located on in South Fort Myers off of Oligo Road. The actual address is 16770 Link Court. Talk to us about how you promote your events. Uh, we promote it primarily through social media, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, uh, Google. Uh, pretty much, you know, our website, of course. and You, know, you got a lot of followers? Yeah, we have. We have quite a few followers and we get, you know, once we post something, we have a lot of people that are, are good friends and clients and they, you know, a lot of them come out and, you know, they support us all the time when we have events. So very good. It's out pretty good. Very good. Yep. Patty. Yeah. And John, we want to do uh, to say about the, the Ross shot bar. Uh, they are doing a car and bike show every other Saturday and Von Baron is actually a part of it that, um, you know, will, will be a part of the show. Saturday. Every other Saturday. So where is that, Saturday Patty? Coming yeah, up? It's, it's Saturday. Okay, so it's this Saturday coming up again. It's at Ross Shot, Shot Bar on Winkler. Okay. Twenty two forty five Winkler Avenue, starting at two p.m. Okay. Uh, what part of Winkler is that? Uh, it's right off of Winkler and Metro. Okay. Very good. Very good. Okay. So they can just Google that and find the address and shoot over there. Yep. Okay. Anything else we have to talk to Chris about, Patty? Before we well, take a break. I just want to say thank you so much, Chris, for coming in uh, to the podcast. And we just really, really love and thank you for supporting the Biker Mouth all these years. And uh, just love you and Tina. So definitely come on out and uh, visit Von Baron Motorcycles when you have a chance. You will definitely love it. It has like a little bar area in the front. So come on out and hang out, see their inventory. Uh, not only do they do motorcycles, but they also... Um, have a couple of car sales that they have been doing and things like that. So definitely check their Facebook page. And uh, Chris, tell us your website again. VonBaronMotorcycles.com. Very good. Very good. Well, everybody, that's Chris from Von Baron Motorcycles. We have more to come. You're listening to the Biker Map Live. We'll be right back after this.